Let's welcome Riley Breaker to the Ozarks Live stage with her song, Never Been to Nashville. Take it away. Say it's a town full of neon dreams. Go to find your music destiny. Get a little taste of honky tonk legacy. They say it's a town full of neon lights, all the southern sounds and countrysides, putting in the work to try and make a life. Oh, but I wouldn't know. Maybe someday I can go. But I've never been to Nashville, never walked the city streets. I've never played in a downtown bar or sang some karaoke. Never thought that I've had my chance of making history or write a music story about a little old me. Now I've never been to Nashville, but I can dream. They say it's a town where you get found out, your work pays off, you make your mama proud. Find the fan club that'll sing your songs real loud. They say it's a town where your dreams come true Contracts, records, venues too Next thing you know someone's opening for you Oh, but I wanna see Cause I want that for me But I've never been to Nashville Never walked the city streets I've never played in a downtown bar or sang some karaoke. Never thought that I'd had my chance of making history or write a music story about little old me. No, I've never been to Nashville, but I can dream. I've never been to the music city, never seen the views, but I've heard they're pretty. Never thought I'd get well known from a music scene. No, I've never seen anybody make it, but if I get the chance, you can bet I'll take it. Hoping it'll all work out if I just believe. Cause I've never been to Nashville, never walked the city streets. I've never played in a downtown bar. Or sang some karaoke, never thought that I'd have my chance of making history or write a music story about a little old me. No, I've never been to Nashville, but I got a dream. Yeah, I've got a dream. So good, so good. Okay, well, I also want to introduce you to Gretchen Peters because you two have a joint event coming up this weekend. But before we get to that, I want to know how long have you been playing? Uh, about seven years. And I understand you write some of your own music. How old were you when you wrote your first song? I wrote my first song about nine years old. Nine years old. That's amazing. <laughs> and what's like your inspiration when you're writing? Um, I just write about my own life because it's the only thing I know. And if I write about others, it's because I'm nosy. <laughs> <laughs> limited life experience right now. Yeah. And where can people find your music? Do you have it like online somewhere? Yeah. So all major streaming platforms. That's never been in Nashville. And you can find that one on Spotify, iTunes, and Apple Music as well. Perfect. Okay. So your next gig, though, if we want to see you in person, is actually at a book launch. Yep. This is where Gretchen comes in. Gretchen, you're an author. This is a book that you're launching this coming weekend, right? Yes. The Artichoke Heart. Okay, tell us about this book. Okay, this book is one that I wrote especially for families. It is all about family culture. It's about relationships. It's about um, a little girl and her family movie night and how her mom made it especially special for them and kind of built up their family culture and things that are memorable for them. Yeah, and you've written a few other books as well. Yes, I have written several educational books. So I was a public school teacher yeah. Yeah. and then I went on to work in the homeschool realm and so yeah I just really love helping families to have success. Yeah you have a very rich history in education I know that and working with students and uh, this book I know kind of yeah. kind of zooms in on the family life and education. Yes. 
Um, so this book launch that you're having, yeah. tell us the details, like when and where is it? Okay, it's at Sunrise Baptist Church and it's this Saturday from okay. 10 to noon. And it's just gonna be a really, really fun time for families to come. It's a full family event. Uh, families can come and they'll get to listen to the amazing Riley mm -hmm. Breaker. Uh -huh. uh, we're gonna be doing a lot of encouraging people to dream dreams. So we're gonna have Marla Lucas, who is a radio host, mm -hmm. talking about how she coaches authors. Okay. Um, I'm gonna get to do a live reading. So we'd love to have little kids there to get to hear the story. And um, it's just gonna be fun. We're gonna have charcuterie. We're gonna mm -hmm. have all sorts of fun stuff going on and there'll be book signings and yeah. Everyone should come out. So how can people get tickets? And do you need them in advance? Uh, yes, um, we're doing tickets so that we have a good count of numbers for, for people. And also you get a free book with that. Uh, you can go on highfivehub.com artichoke and get registered. And with that ticket, you also get a copy of the book, correct? Yes, you do. Yes. And one last thing, I just wanna know when you said you're gonna like, help people dream what exactly are you thinking about so so yeah we just want to really inspire people uh -huh. so so first off there's also sarah bradford burton will be there she was the illustrator okay. and so she's going to be talking about how she got into being an illustrator mm -hmm. we're going to have people just talking about how they got into music uh, you know you just can encouraging. do anything that you want yeah, to do and All not right. to give up perfect it sounds like a fun family event so thank, thank you both for being here we have loved it thank you all right we will be right back